Oh, sheesh! Alright guys, how's it going? My name's Sice, it's Task Force Gaming, and we are back with another survival adventure. We're on the Infected version 13.0.6, and I put on Twitter earlier to the developer, and I was just like, I'm going to give Infected a go, and he's like, private messaged me and said, we've got an update coming soon. I was like, alright, I'll play after that. So just had the update, some uh, improvements, and something about taking out Horde mode, but I never played this, so I have no idea what I'm getting into. So, this is episode one, I hope you enjoy the series. I've just, I've just done Mist and it did very well and uh, everyone was saying how much they loved it so this is the next adventure guys new game let's have a look I think I should leave it all apart from the head bubble let's disable that Vambies right so this is vampires and zombies yeah sheep I mean let's just leave it how it is um, type the name game Right, we're on the task force adventures, boys. Let's go. No idea. It's just going to be... I like to do certain things when I load up an adventure game or a survival game. Um, I like to explore the whole map. I like to establish a base. I like to get geared up. Full decent set of gear. Lots of storage sorted. Wow. This looks pretty vast. We are on Ultra. For everything, we're absolutely maxed out the settings. Uh, looks fine by me. Look at this. Very nice. Alright, so this is my life now. Health, stam, water, food. Uh, obviously, it's daytime. Does that affect when the Vambies come? Hold F to view the tutorial stats. Alright, so that's where my compass is. Gather stone, gather stick. Uh, all right, all right. Let's make some. Maybe. Bit... Let's make some stuff. Oh, hello. So, construction placeables. Oh, hello. Saw bench, workbench. Look at all this construct. Construction. I heard something. Pick up stick. Pick up stone. Pick up another stone. Craft axe. Uh, oh, all right. So we've got a little crafting tail. So stick. No. Yep, stick. Stone. Craft axe. Okay. Um. Okay. Now I've got a backpack. In the backpack, I've got the food. It's a bit like the forest sort of set out. Um, okay, do I press one? Alright, looking good. Um, let's go for a stone blade now. So I'm guessing... Stone. Stone blade. Sorted. Uh okay, that's that. Uh... Oh, hello. We can make armor and things. Okay. That's... Okay. Oh, wow. Fridge, solar panel, battery loom, lamp, stove. Wow, there's loads of stuff in here. So basically just build a massive base, I'm guessing. Right, I need a workbench for that. Plank and nails. Alright. Oh, yeah. Build a saw bench. All that stuff. Right, well, we've got an axe. Oh, I'm carrying a log. Don't need that. Let's have a little explore. We've got a map. Hello. Fishing. Crocodiles and stuff. What are these X's on the map? Let's uh, let's head over and have a look. Right, we're coming up to the X marks the spot on the map. We've got player location, cart location, vehicle location. Hello. Oh, swamp. Fish. A cave. That's got to be it. Oh god, it's going to have the uh, the Vambies in there. I'm going to build a... Um, I kind of want a spear or something, don't I? Alright, let's check out the cave, guys. I've only got an axe. T for torch. L for light. F for flash. No. Okay, we haven't got anything. I reckon there's going to be some Vambies in here. Yeah, I think I need the pickaxe in here just to get the mineable stuff. Alright. So this location is a cave. A massive pumpkin! 
Oh. What the hell? That looked very colourful and probably slightly poisonous. Where did... Oh, I got pumpkin seeds. Okay. Yeah. I suppose you could eat them, but... Not very much sust... Jesus Christ. The lacoon. Right. Onwards to the next cross. So we're going to another swamp there. You chill out, mate. You should build a base, gather supplies. Build workbenches and stuff. Make armour, make clothes. Make weapons. We've got a hell of a to-do list. Hello. Look at this. This is a brilliant starting look. Well, I mean, it's the first... Ooh, there's a whole, like, village. Alright, that's a surprise to come across. This isn't even on the map. Oh, man, I can zoom in. Okay, maybe it is on the map. Alright. Yeah, there's more houses there. Oh, baby, look at these. Alright. Ah, I might be able to find actual things then. Not have to craft everything. Look at this, boys. Feathers, electrical parts. I'm not going to absolutely overencumber myself just yet. I'm going to find a weapon. Toilet, bath. Can't leave that. A bone, right, so you can actually make a spear from these. Bone shards. Oh, that's something glowing through the map there. What is that? An animal. I like my animal instincts. Oh, come on, there's easy pizza in there. What's that? Wire. Picked up, I can't help it. I need to loot everything, I think. It's like a carry capacity. What is this green potion? Biofuel. Right, we're going to leave some stuff in the house. We don't know what everything is. More wire. Oh, there's some shuffling noises outside. I haven't even seen one. A small stone next to your bed. Maybe a self-defense weapon. Oh, man. Right, an oil can. Ah. Love some food. These people aren't being shopping. There's a bathroom again. There's the back door. Hello. Brum brum car. Look at this thing. No, mate. I didn't know you was a daytime zombie. Bam. Bam. I don't think this counts as a weapon. Oh, I am so dead. He got me through the door. Um, so. Axe not a weapon. I'm infected. I need to use medical bandages. Oh, I've got beef stew, pumpkin slice, and a flask. I need a better weapon, that's for sure. I haven't done anything. We'll just use this lifetime. Look, there he comes. Oh, damn. Oh, got me through the door again. <laughs> Uh, that was good. Uh, so, got me through the door there. Well, I spawned with my stuff. I spawned with my axe, no way. Right, let's see where we spawn. Just random spot. Okay. Alright, All right, it's getting dark now, guys. I need to find some um, shelter and stuff, so. I can only go as fast as my little legs can take me. Pumpkin slice. Oh, I still my stamina a bit. Oh, there's carbohydrates, fats, and protein and stuff. Oh. My. God. That thunder and lightning and stuff. Oh, my days, man. That sounded good. Look at the ground and that as well. That's actually pretty impressive, thunder and lightning there. Yes, yeah, so. There's a story about this. Um, so the guy out surviving... He kills an elk. And he literally, he's got, he's eating thousands of calories a day. He's, um, he's only eating meat. 
but he dies of starvation because um, you do need fats and carbs to survive, to live. And because he was just eating meat constantly, you was at, you're actually starving to death. You, you eat yourself to death. It's, it's weird, man. So you do need that. So a proper survival game actually has carbs and fats in it. Like this one, which is really good. Like Green Hell had it down to a T. Uh, this has got it down pretty good. But then you've got uh, things like Scum, which is so over the top, man. Literally every every number and letter of vitamin. I'm getting a bit um, paranoid now. But yeah, that that's awesome detail, honestly. There's quite a lot of houses to search here. Let's have a little loot around. This is just like a little get to know it episode to have a little feel for it. Shut the door behind me, I don't know if... Damn, that is like a horror movie. Cucumber seeds, wires. I can't fight with this axe. So that's pretty useless. A baked potato, already baked, nice. Cloth, right, bits of cloth we can actually make clothes. Biofuel, I'm gonna pick that up. Can we craft on the workbench? There's alternative fuel for the mineral extractor. Okay, cool, so there's a mineral, uh, lead ore. There's a the bathroom. Right. I'm going to leave the back door open on stuff. At least you know where the village is, where there's a car. So we can actually... It tells me what I needed, but then that Bambi killed me, so... Right, two bones there. Oh, so larger backpack. Look, croc skin and rope. Animal hide and rope. Make a quiver there. Definitely need to get something ranged going on. Firewood, rope, and stealing got. Right, saw bench. Right, four logs will make a saw bench. And then I can make planks, which will make that. Ten nails. Tech not obtained on all these. Right, let's go get four logs. <laughs> Douche! Bam! Oh, it says, oh no. Did I just get, um. Oh, some stats are low. Let's eat beef stew. Well, that did everything. Oh, yeah, right. I thought because I uh, cooked, touched raw chicken. Three. Right, I can carry three. Let's go lob these down. A douche. Let's go get some hot. A douche. Right. So can I craft this by just standing near the stuff? Oh, okay. And I put it into it. I can't build inside. Okay, well, I mean, I'll do. Who put in like this? Okay. Right, right, right. So it's a bit like the forest in that sense. Boom. So now we've got this. Right, add logs and take planks. Delete to remove, end to move. Oh, you, you can move stuff as well, at least. Right, okay. So we're going to get some of these again, and we are going to add log. And it's just going to sit there and do it. Okay, and that's the planks. Oi, that's pretty cool. Easily impressed, you see. I'm going to have to build my own wood logs and planks. That's it. Wood log and planks. You can build your own house. That's actually insane. Ah, power, furniture, food. Okay. Uh, six planks for a bed. Let's clear out some crap. 
<laughs> oh, and it snapped. Oh, we can make a sick house. We're going to make a sick house. Right, so what is this? Right. So there goes my planks. Now we need some logs. Okay, so now we've uh, we've got our first foundation down. It's middle of the night. I just literally need to plonk a bed on it so we can get a snooze and maybe pass this de this night time. And then I think we're actually just going to go build a, like find a base location and just try and smash some stuff out. Really, you want like three of these in a row, so it's like ba ba ba. But we'll do that next time. We'll just make infinite planks. So there you have it, guys. Nice be bed. Um, Six planks for that. Six. Ha <laughs> ha! We made a bed! I'll start off small. Oh, well, we need a drink. I need to wake up. Okay, sort of morning. Yeah, I think this is just a little test run, guys. Um, just figuring it out, having a little explore. And then we're going to just crack straight into it in the next episode. We're going to pick a location on the map. Help me out. Put in the comments if there's any good things, any good places to go. Um, so I have no idea. Okay, so we need to be near, near a load of houses. Like the end of this road. Look at all this. And a water source there as well, right in front of me. Let's go check that out, Queen. I don't think you're going to be able to drink straight from it without... Oh, sheesh! He infected me with one swing and all. You boys. <laughs> right, so we've got the building building down. We learned a little bit. So next time we're going to pick a location, build it up, get some weapons crafted. Three bandages. That might actually save me. Oh, God, he's in. Oh, God. Um. Come on in, boys. That's it. Got the range. One more hit and I'm dead. Oh, I was bleeding. Oh my god, did it just spot? Right, it spawns me on the bed, man. I keep my stuff. And I keep my stuff. Interesting. That's not too bad then, so if I build a bed, so I might as well build around here somewhere then. Oh, my bed is floating. That is funny. Yeah, we'll delete that. Look, they're here again. Well, you can hit him with the axe, it's just not very effective. Yeah, yeah. Ah. Right, good. We got the spawn we wanted. Middle of nowhere. Um, oh, my axe is having a moment. There we go. So, yeah, we're back round here again. All right. Uh, I did want to test the water. There is some in front of me. Oh, add water. What is that? Dirty water. Yeah. So that'll make me feel poorly in my tum-tum, I think. Oh, look at this. Right, yeah, and that'll do me for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Not a lot going on. First episode is always the same. Walk around, get used to the game, have a little craft, have a little build, uh, see what's what. Second episode is going to be way better. So we're just going to... This is such a flat area as well. Right next to this pond, I'm thinking it's a sick location. Um, if we can build a bed here, we'll spawn as well. Got some houses to loot over there close by. There's a couple of caves in, a, in the middle of three caves there. We've got water supply, so we can build some sort of um, uh, water cleaner thing. And then, this is all flat. We could slap down a decent-sized house here. Get some barbed wire on the go, you know what I mean? Get some electricity. And defend our house against the Vambies. So that's going to be pretty sick. So thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Help me out in the comments. Uh, tell me what you think of the series. And uh, see you next one. Peace.